In this video we're going to be talking about the Badger Extreme Patriot air valve. The air valve assembly part number is X50036. And to remove the air valve from the airbrush we will first take the needle out and the knee, the trigger we'll get our padded grips and gently just grip and give it a tweak and it will come undone unscrew and to disassemble the air valve we will use our allen key again just a quick tweak and that will come undone and remove the air valve screw push the plunger down the spring will drop out make sure you do it in the middle of the table so as not to lose any of the parts and there are all the parts for the air valve which are all available separately in our store. The O-ring which fits onto the plunger is part 50-0141. The plunger and the O-ring is part number 50-014. The screw is part number 50-015, the spring is part number 50-020. There is also, you can purchase the casing, the valve casing on its own and that part number is X50-013 To reassemble the air valve we put the plunger in first then the spring the screw being careful with the threads using the allen key just lightly nip it up screw back into the airbrush Using the padded pliers, just gently nip it up, no force needed. We will then pull the back lever back so we can fit the tr trigger into situ. And as a rule of thumb, if the trigger is sitting in line of the centre line of the air valve, it is normally sitting in the correct position and if you just gently push it down you can feel the spring working in the air valve so we know it's in the correct position slide the needle in nice and gently and once the needle stops don't give it any force whatsoever tighten the needle chuck up and that is the removal and replacement of the air valve with the air valve parts and part numbers. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, turn notifications on so you don't miss future content.